it's race day and our drivers are all out on the grid performing their final checks before we get underway here at the Bahrain International Circuit. Formula One returns to the desert today on this exceptional 3.36 mile circuit. 15 corners provide plenty of overtaking opportunities. It could be a strategic race this one, with Sakir notorious for eating up the rear tyres. Watch out for drivers managing their rubber at some point during the Grand Prix. Anthony Davidson joins me once again in the commentary box, and it's fantastic to have you with us here today. But I'm curious, as a man with experience out on the track, how do you stop those pre-race nerves from becoming overwhelming when you're lining up on the grid? Well, from the moment qualifying's over, you start to feel the adrenaline in your body build up and the buzz in your stomach as you anticipate the run down into Turn 1. It's all a bit like going into battle, and the unknown situation makes you nervous. Those pre-race nerves are a good thing. The day you don't have them means that you don't care anymore. And of course, you have to make sure that all the procedures are second nature to you so that they're not taking up too much of your capacity. Let's run you through the driver grid order for today's exciting race. Lewis Hamilton lines up on pole position and it's Charles Leclerc in P2. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Verstappen, Bottas, Sergio Perez and Ricardo, Norris, Vettel, Stroll and Carlos Sainz, Fernando Alonso, Gasly, Kimi Raikkonen and Sonoda, Ocon, Russell, Antonio Giovinazzi and Mick Schumacher, Latifi and Nikita Mazepin. It's almost time for the lights to go out, so let's head down to the track and get this Grand Prix underway.
We can now use DRS. DRS now available. Okay, pick up rubber and bring it home. That's it for another spectacular Grand Prix here in Bahrain and a real champion's drive to take the win. So, Anthony, what made the difference out there today? I think that smart tyre management on track and very smooth driving definitely assisted in their victory today. That combination meant they got the absolute maximum out of their tyres at all times. Mercedes are on top form once again after an excellent race weekend. It's great to see them up on that podium once again. Let's focus on the driver of the day, Anthony Davidson. Who do you pick? Well, there's no question in my mind, it has to go to George Russell. What a performance. He's got every right to be proud of what he accomplished out there today. Well, Ant, an end to another fantastic weekend of...